Good morning. I'm trying to be consistent with my videos, but really, um, I'm quite excited for today's shenanigans because I'm gonna meet my aunt. It's quite kind of like a special uh, moment for me, I guess, because we never ever had, um, we never talked for years now, but the reunion feels so good i guess and i don't think i will vlog a lot of details going through the vlog for today but i'll let you in for a little bit of my day later so but first things first i'm gonna do my makeup after i mean i did shower and you can clearly see that I didn't sleep so much. I had, I mean, I fucked up my sleeping schedule and I've been so unhealthy these past few days. I don't know why I do that to myself. I think I want, I, I want to let you guys in a little bit of my life update kind of. And also it's been two months since my last video and I uploaded a another video for this month which is good i need to slowly build up my youtube channel to be more consistent i guess it's just that i really don't know what to talk or what kind of content i need to direct myself in because i do enjoy like makeup stuff oh my god <laughs> you can clearly see my fucking eye bags <laughs> I'm having a moment here but really yeah so I'm quite excited for what's to come for later and uh, it's nice that she surprised me with um, it's like a dessert mostly not not really dessert but it's like um, say a delicacy delicacy in the Philippines because the last Easter uh, weekend, um, my husband went to his dad, and I was fine. I was fine being alone at home, but I never really did anything like food-wise. I didn't cook. It's called benignit show. So my aunt cooked that for me today so we're gonna have a little bonding um moment later and also like a chicken tenola which is and i'm actually gonna cook for her tomorrow we're gonna try to cook um mung beans like the mongo beans so yeah that's exciting for me at least I was hella bored um like the past few weeks so yeah uh, i need to finish my um skincare routine actually this place is only the best like lighting in this apartment <laughs> so i already did my brows okay i really don't think i look good in this turtleneck I'm glad that my hair is trying to grow. Can't wait for it to really grow back. I kind of am tired with the boy um, boy cut look. I don't know if it's really nice on me, but it's fine. So yeah, I'm pretty much excited to meet my aunt today. It's been a long time since I saw her. The last time I saw her probably was like around when I was in my first or second year of high school. So kind of like nine to ten years for probably. So yeah, 
it's a long history and then you know back like during the time that we we're kids i just we just don't wanna like be a part of the adult um problems i guess i mean there's no such thing as perfect or even like a perfect family everyone has their own issues but i guess for me i just don't want like i just want neutrality i just want to be neutral actually for the family members so i'm glad that i'm able to reconnect and was able to chit chat with my um aunt so how i got reconnected with her is through our like social media or like facebook and then i was on not like a uh, yeah i was on a call a video call with my cousin and then while i was scrolling through our social media there was this um specific facebook account that had similar um middle name as me and my cousin and i was like who is she and then i visited her facebook page and it's like she's in norway and then i didn't really recognize her face at first but then like it's my aunt so I just don't want to name names just for private, um, personal space to respect the pri uh, privacy. And then um, I then added her. Wait, what's the first thing I need to do? I then added her and then she immediately um, accepted my friend request. And then she immediately chatted me. And then from then on, after sh after after she uh, chatted me on my messenger, I ended up wanting to visit her as well. So it's really nice. It's a nice feeling that as we grow older, we try to reconnect with our loved ones who actually was, you know, like, for example, like we're away when we were young and stuff happens, of course. So yeah, it's a really nice feeling that we're trying to reconnect with people who did, we didn't talk for long, especially with when it comes to, you know, family members. I'm sorry for rambling while I didn't do quick enough. I didn't do much with my makeup routine because I was rambling on and on. I forgot what to do for the next step because I'm really new to being so open on, I mean, especially on social media such as like a big, big platform such as YouTube. And then I'm just really trying to overcome my mm, awkwardness in front of the camera. So I really don't know like how to say my thoughts. I tend to stutter a lot. So um, yeah, like for example, I always use so and yeah meet her in the middle of the town I'm gonna ride a train on the way to her place oh this is um this is really good for oily for my oily gals and pals out there this concealer works nicely but i think i need to really set it with a translucent powder because it kind of tends to crease. I mean, all concealers really do tend to crease. I think it's just a wearability over time. 
So how are you guys? Um, I'm talking to the void here. So if any of you are still watching, that's what I've said in the last video. Thank you so much. And um, yeah, so how are y'all doing during the quarantine and lockdown and during the pandemic? I am. I was struggling to really do something even if i'm just inside the house because i feel like i wasn't really in my best mindset i'm trying to cope up and my husband is just a very like it's he's the best supporter because he's always there for me even if i feel like I don't want to do anything or I feel down. So I think I'm just going to finish my makeup and then I'll see you guys later. So as you guys can see, I'm all glammed up. I don't know, it just makes me feel so alive when I do my makeup. It's just my stress reliever, I guess. So yeah, I don't think I regret doing this glam instead of having the natural dewy makeup look because I really want to have the attention onto my eyes because I know I'm gonna wear a mask out in public so yeah that's what I want to go for and this is my um, outfit of the day I really am into neutrals nowadays and it's kind of chilly outside even though it's very sunny then go ahead and um ask her permission for this vlog and she knows about this vlog right now so yeah it's all good so i finished packing for two days i'm gonna be there so yeah i've all prepared what i need to have and um of course finally got my package don't want to show the address of course so yeah i just ran a little errand because i finally will try and test this out it's from geek and gorgeous so right before i'll um go to my aunt i need to stop first stop by the post so i'm pretty much excited to use this one <laughs> Hello. Simple kailang ilang kwan ba kay ilang mall murag park. Idili siya indoor. So hi guys, we're on our way to the city. Me and my aunt is walking down the road because it's just not that far from here. And then, um, disclosure: I will fully speak in our dialect because just so you know it's comfortable for the both of us to speak in the video because she's so cool to speak and do something for my vlog also so which is nice <laughs> say hi to the vlog me hi, hi. good morning so <laughs> me what you lucky so it's I know it's eight degrees in Askel right now. Ang naka bugnaw jud kay ang hangin. Askel eight degrees at tuwa. Like sa mo ang six. There's no snow. Like really, wala jud ano. Wala snow at all jud sa pagkakaron. It's so sunny pero weird kay ang weather mino. Kwan mong gud sa? Hangin mong gud. Hmm. But at least, I didn't know that I was going to die. Yes, I was going to die. 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 I
sentro na. So, say, tinuguhan nga na po kayo ko kung mag-bas-bas pa ko. Ay, lamik kayo maglakaw-lakaw. Ano nga weather labi na summer? Maglakaw, saka pa doon dito ka, saka ka. Oo. Ah, okay. Sus. Sir, hindi ay masakara mo na. Di mo na mag-bas. Saka to, yung hangkuan mi. Dito pa kasi ka na. Dito kayo. Yan po, mangkol. Size ko na pataas. Oo, nindot. May sir size din. Ano nga nga. Lailihit lang. Nice pa ito. Nindot kayong balay. Tawa nga nga lailihit lang. Mararap ka ng mga sayana. It's been a long time ever since nag meet Jutami. <laughs> Just my god, 10 years. I was so little before, but now I'm a lady. Char. <laughs> who would who would have thought uh, Yeah, who would who would have thought that we're able to meet up here in Norway out of yeah. all places in the <laughs> in the world <laughs> not in philippines it's not Sama ni mungkin kau nane. Beauty. So it's like library, sha. Like a library. Was it all about like culture, jadi sa liang komuna? Hmm. Tapi sih cinema, esino man. Yeah. Open nama nak apotek, me pasca ano? Ang mga food lang, ang food stalls. Ang mga boring kayo ito. Ang mga talang. True. All the stores are closed. For the day, gonna have corona. For now, it's closed for now. Okay, mag-quarantine na po. Cute lang ano. At least open ang pet zoo. Nga kuha ng store. Oh. Cute kayo. Nagbuba na yung kuha ng collar. Noon sa Pinas kay Bibo lang give me no. Kaya every Sunday na ay open ba? Oh. Ano ba nila? Ang dito. Tapos mo ay kinadakan nila nga ano mall. Mas siya pinag-isanong style. Ano sila kay mo call lang ka para imo i-click and collect ang imong gi shop. I mean though like although it's halfway closed. Pwede ka makapalit. Pero social distance pud mo. So yeah, they always give you a heads up if ever open sila. Like halfway open, I mean. Hey, hello. <laughs> Nagkuhan ta, nag-snack, nag-ikan. Nag-video din, no? Oo, nag-video. Nag-picture na yun. 
<laughs> oh, okay, okay, Rameki, okay. guapa liwat. Guapa rata liwat ni. <laughs> so, Munishan train station sa uh, Askit. Taas po siya nga line. Gayo sana. Oh, bitaw no? Nara po sa kilid ni ba? Ah, mga bus na dito. I'm gonna make some pork mongo beans. This is my favorite from the Filipino, um, you know, like culture. I don't think it's like a very Filipino, but probably most of the Asian countries do have their own pork mongo beans. So yeah, just trying to saute the onion and garlic and then the pork and mongo beans. And um, I had the coconut cream a while ago. So yeah, I'm gonna enjoy our meal time. And it's all done. Mm. Okay. Well, we're here in the Asked Golf Club. And straight down that road, the golf course is up there, Pami, golf course. This is the big lake they have. It's frozen. Frozen, Panami, no? So we're gonna stop in this little hut for a while because we're gonna take a short break from the stroll 